Good morning, bird. They haven't even realized that they can go out yet. There you go, look. I haven't let the birds out to completely free range in a while, so figured that I should probably do that today. Hey boys. Where are you going, Jenna? See them. Sounds like you're just about ready to lay an egg. Oh. Yeah? The other day, Gabriel must have flown out of the bird run because the neighbors noticed there was an extra friendly duck down in the creek, which is quite a ways behind our house. So today we need to clip swings. Great. Really, I would rather let his wings grow back, but I can't have him leaving the bird run every day and having to go get him down by the creek. So, until he gets better at that, he's gonna have to keep his wings trimmed. Good job. So, who are the teams, boys against the girls? Do you want me to record this? Hey, mom. You know, this looks a lot like croquet. So. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what it is. What is it? It's called kick croquet. It's, okay. It's ask how many times croquet. I guess you have to kick on the top. Congratulations. Why do I keep saying congratulations today? Yay. Okay, girls up. Then when you go through a hoop, even coming back out, you get an extra kick. Okay. So when you go through there, you're gonna go try to get it through the yellow hoop going that way. Hi Ziggy. Okay. Okay. Croquet unofficial croquet with us. Right? You've played unofficial croquet with us. Yeah, I played at my house too years and years ago. Oh. Where are they gonna get No one's ever gonna make it through. <laughs> Dang it. I'm so terrible at these games! Oh, 
Gotta get to the flag. Oh, you could just regular, kick, regularly kick it. I guess ball. aim where it's just towards the wind's blowing this way. Yeah, so I want to aim it over there. Aim it towards the, the black. Uh, I want to aim it for the bucket almost. Okay. Ta -da. <laughs> oh, that was horrible. Oh, good shot. You almost got it through. So my daughter wanted to get more chickens to add to her chicken flock. So we went to our local chicken place and I knew that we'd have to get multiple so I thought we'd be getting three chickens, bringing home three chickens. You wanted two though. Well I wanted two. <laughs> but I knew we had to get three. I figured we'd have to get three. When we got there we found out we had to bring home four chickens. But while we were looking at the chickens that were there, we saw one that didn't look like it was in very good shape and it might not make it, you know, through the day. We, you know, thought it was pretty sick chicken, little chick. So we brought that home with us. I was thinking it wasn't going to make it through the night, but it did. So we went from two chickens to three to four to five. Yay. And now we have five chickens. Five more chickens yeah, in that, our chicken that equals pack. nine. So as you can see the chickens are much bigger than they were just a few weeks ago and I missed a lot of uploading days where I should have uploaded a bunch of YouTube videos. I was busy getting things done around the house but I did record a bit so I'll show you some cute clips from the past few weeks. So, Lucky can squeeze through the wires on the cage, and uh, I have found out why. Maggie! Maggie! Oh my God. <laughs> Lucky! Lucky! Beep, 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 beep! Beep, beep, beep! Lucky! So he is definitely attached to me, but also attached to the others. I brought Phoenix out so he could be happy while looking for me, right buddy? He's just a social little baby.
It's incredible how quiet they are in the morning. Yet at night, it's like they're trying to keep me up for hours and hours. Hi guys, how's it going? All right, guys, I'm going to clean your cage. You ready? You ready, Francis? Wow, you can really see those adult feathers coming out in Iris. See that? He's definitely a silver sea bright. So while the chicks have been in here, Spirit has not been allowed inside. But the chicks are getting bigger and they are old enough to meet Spirit. Spirit was, actually grew up with our ducklings, so I have no doubt that he'll be okay with the baby birds, and I'm really interested to see what they do. Uh, Maggie wants in too, even though she's kind of scared. I'm not going to let Spirit get too close and absolutely scare the chickens, but get the chicks used to being around a cat so that... When they're adults, they'll be coexistent in peace. What do you think, Spirit? Yeah, Spirit does not care. You're just watching them, Spirit? What's up, guys? You can really see they're all of their adult feathers coming in on their wings. Like, you're on Phoenix. Francis, you're so pretty. You too, Lucky. I really love Iris's wings, though. I think Maggie's more interested in them than Spirit is. What do you think, buddy? Are they cool? Yeah, they're cool. Hello, Francis! What's up? Spirit's just staring at them, like, so confused. 
It's a smaller version of what's outside, Spirit. Isn't that cool? He just walks away like he doesn't care whatsoever. Just like, goodbye.